Seems like they're mostly cartoons of some kind. She's never came and gotten these. She's... There's a bunch of VHSs. It's like mostly cartoons of some kind. They seem to be alphabetized, save for a few stray sticky ones. Entry number four. Well, why is it back here? I don't know. I've been researching the humans to see if I can find any info about their souls. You were right. We were missing four. I ended up snooping around the castle and found these weird tapes. I don't feel like Asgore's watched them. I don't think he should. vegetable. Hmm. Carrots, right? No, no, no. My favorite vegetable is Ed Money. Ed Money. Get it? Go back to bed, dear. No, no, not yet. <laughs> now, if I were, were a dog, what breed of dog would I be? A goat. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know, honey. What kind of dog would you be? I would be a Mamaranian. What? Oh, ho, ho, ho. you sure are excited to be this, to have this child. You know, if you keep making jokes like this, one day you could be a famous mom, <laughs> Mamadian. <laughs> well. I'm going to bed. Hey, <laughs> come on, Tori. That one was funny. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm just teasing you. Good night, dear. Good night, honey. Oh, dear. Perhaps it was too dark in here for the video to come out. <laughs> okay, Brock. Are you ready? What? Do your creepy face. Ah! Hee 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 hee. Oh, yeah, wait. Brock, all right. I have the lens cap on. What? You're not going to do it again. Oh, who do you think? Come on. Quit tricking me. <laughs> Don't know Brock. <laughs> Howdy, Brock. Smile for the camera. Hey, this time I got you. I put the cap on. On purpose. Now you're smiling for no reason. <laughs> what? Oh yeah, I remember. When we tried to make butterscotch pie for Dad, right? The recipe asked for cups of butter, but we accidentally put in butter cups instead. Yeah, those flowers got him really sick. I felt so bad. We made Mom really upset. I should have laughed it off like you did. Um, anyway, where are you going with this? Huh? Turn off the camera? Okay. You know... <laughs> I... I don't like this idea, Brock. Uh, wh what? No, I'm not... Big kids don't cry. Yeah, you're right. No, I never doubt you, Brock. Never. Yeah. We'll be strong. We'll be. Fr we'll free everyone. I'll go get the flowers. Uh. Rock, can you hear me? We want you to wake up. Rock, you have to stay determined. You can't give up. You are the future of the hu of humans and monsters. Psst. Rock, please wake up. I don't like this plan anymore. I, 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 no, I said, I said I'd never doubt you. Six, right? We just have to get six, and we'll do it together, right? Huh? No, no, I didn't want to do that! Confusion. <laughs> 
confusion. Well, I'm sure it'll explain it in the true ending. DT extractor machine determination extractor machine status inactive. Why does it look like a skull? It looks like. Oh, right. good! More of this shit! Some of the hair is worn, boys. There's nothing here yet. We'll come back later when I can see. Oh, you mean this? this is, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we're going. It's just slightly less. Entry number 11. Now that Nat Times made it big, he never talks to me anymore. Except to ask when I'm going to finish his body. But I'm afraid if I finish his body, he won't need me anymore. Then we'll never be friends ever again. That's a mission. Every time I try to work on it, I just re get really sway. Gross. Alright, time to get the ventilation system going. Dog monster! Five legs! You wanna go? You wanna go, bro? Six legs. Dog. Um. Oh no! It's shooting thingies. Arrows. Going the other way. Huh? Oh boy. It's a. Uh, oh no. Rocket dog. Rocket dog. Back in again. No, not the arrow. Move faster. Stage one was hip. Uh, it's uh, frothing at the mouth. Uh, it wants more uh, pet. Go in that one room, we couldn't. We can't see a goddamn thing. <laughs> There's a refrigerator, it's empty. Entry number 19. The families keep calling me to ask when everyone's coming home. What am I supposed to say? I don't even answer the phone anymore. Asko left me five messages today at his scary fridge, four about everyone being angry, one about this cute teacup he found that looks like me. Thanks, Asko. It's a refrigerator. 
It's empty. Bullshit. Where is it? It is the refrigerator. It's so cold. Ew. The molten vegetable. <laughs> I remember. I wonder if these are the monsters that Alfie is. Yeah, that looks like a snow drake. And then vegetal or the vegetable. So all the monsters fused together. They really did not go back, you know, go to your families and now they're trying to kill us and they're going blue key. From the blue key. Which means we have all of them. Look. Now we gotta go all the fuck way back. What is this? It's supposed to be a. Is it malfunctioning? Yeah. Apparently. Uh. <laughs> oh. Walking, keep walking, don't stop walking, just gotta keep walking. Walk some more, walk some more. Oh, finally, we're here. There, that's all of them. Now we gotta go back to the beginning. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh. It's just that he walks so slow. Yeah, Brock. And these areas are huge. Mm. Oh my god, that took forever. Hang on, save. Um, okay. I've never seen an elevator with two doors. Yes, yes, I would love to turn on the fucking elevator. <gasps> Hello, nightmares. Hey, stop. I got you guys some food, okay? Jeez. Oh, Sorry about that. They get, they get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. I think they smelled the potato, put, yeah, the potato chips you had. And anyway, it's potato chips before they put everyone out, and I've been trying to turn it back on. But it seems like you were one step ahead of me. This was probably just a big inconvenience for you, but, but I appreciate that you came here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back, but that's not because of these guys raiding. I just worry that I would be too afraid to tell the truth that I might run away or do something. Kauri. Uh, I I suppose I owe you an explanation. As you probably know, Asker asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I asked a power called determination. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls were lost after death. And the experiment failed. You see, unlike humans, monsters' bodies don't have enough physical matter to take those concentrations of determination. Their bodies start to melt and lost what physically they had. Pretty soon, all the test subjects had melted together into those. Seeing them like this, I knew I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't, I couldn't tell anyone about it, no matter how much everyone was asking me. Yeah, I was too afraid to do any more work, knowing 
everything I've done so far has been such a horrific failure. But now, now I changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I've done. It's going to be hard being honest, believing in myself. I'm sure there will be times where I'll struggle. I'm sure there will be times where I screw up again. But knowing deep down that I have friends to fall back on. I know it will be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Come on guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Da -da 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 Okay. All right. I need more stuff. Uh. Hi, entry number eight. I chose a new candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet because I want to surprise him with. In the center of his garden, there's something special. The first golden flower that grew for all the lovers. The flower from the outside world. It appeared just before the queen left. I wonder what happens when something of a foul soul gains to the world to live. The flower is gone. gone. Yeah, it's flowy. The kill. Like, flowy. It's a voice you have never heard before. Brock, are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? But you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. Brock, see you soon. <coughs> Hey look, we're at the end game again. 